beautiful people welcome to susan and family tv so how are you all doing hope you are doing great as for me and my daughter we are doing super 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 great by his grace amen and we wish the same for you all out there amen so beautiful people welcome to another entertaining educative inspiring interesting video from Sousa and family tv so today is a good weather guys anytime you know it's coming like summer you know i and my daughter we are so super excited because we love like you know when the weather is like coming sunny and everywhere is like you know fresh breeze without putting on the jacket you know so we are all tired our kids are tired of putting on jackets every day <laughs> so we are so happy my daughter is so happy and i am so happy we are thankful to god for the great weather today's weather is so super yesterday also yesterday also weather you know was also very super you know with sunshine and all, all true you know so guys welcome to another you know this is my part three i'm doing part three you know of my walking early money walk so this is my part three and i love to like anytime i want to do my early money walk i love to like do like a she chat video you know so let it not just be like i'm just like walking around and you guys are just only looking at my face not saying something so it's good to like have a chit chat while i'm doing my working early morning work so i'm walking towards my school but first i'm going to go to the supermarket you know so i mean you can see the direction you can see here is may shopping street i'm just entering it now so antwerp's train station is just over there you can see it uh -huh. so <laughs> i've done we have done a lot of videos so many videos about um, may shopping street and this is also the direction i sometimes also take when going to school you know so here is it so beautiful people. so what we'll be doing our chit chat today i'm going to be talking about something that really touched my heart i saw in the video in the shiny not only one <laughs> not only one shiny not only two shiny not only three shiny you know so it's not maybe we are going to put it on just on one shiny you know because it's not only one person who brought out the video you know but when i saw it it faced me a lot i'm the kind of mother when i see things good i give a big thumbs up you know and i rejoice with the team and with whoever you know is doing it and when i see something that is not too good you know kids when something is not good they do this way that means it's not good we have to be truthful as we mothers you know um as humans you know as an adult you know if you do the video if maybe the person that did this video is under 18 i'm not going to be like bothered because under 18 is still a child, you know. They don't know things too much. They are still learning. They have not experienced things in life. Even up to like 18, 20, 21, 22, they are still learning, you know. But anyone that is above like 24 years, I think that person is already a mature adult, you know, to know what is good and what is not good, you know. So sometimes, uh, we come across videos on YouTube. I'm a youtuber also, you know so sometimes Youtubers do do a video that they will write a title a topic that we attract audience That we attract viewers not knowing that you know that topic that they are going to write on their channel is going to tarnage an image of a person you know so in this world when doing things you want to do things to favor you you also have to like do things that thing that you want to do to favor you let it be in the favor of everyone don't just think of only yourself don't just think of only what you are going to like achieve from what you are doing you have to also think of people surrounding you and you have to also think about all this thing you are about to talk about 
is this person going to like it you know so when I saw a video mostly the word I saw a video concerning our actress Genevieve Nanji it touched me I'm a mother I will not lie to you our actress she's an actress from Nigeria in case you are coming across this video and you don't know who you know uh, Genevieve is so Genevieve is an like a Nigeria actress she's a Lollywood actress and uh, to me and to what and to what I also believe Genevieve Nanji is not just a Lollywood actress I think she's also not a Hollywood actress because I've seen some things she had also with Americans you know so she's not only just a Lollywood actress so our beautiful Nigeria actress Genevieve Nanji she's also a Hollywood actress which we the Nigerians we are proud of her you know so it's not easy to like being a Hollywood actress and to be part of Hollywood actress is a very big thumbs up that I've given to our actress Nigeria Genevieve Nanji so huh, I don't know I'm going to put it I think three days ago I came across a video I wanted to do this video since on Saturday you know weekends all the days I'm always a busy mom you know so and weekends I'm also busy I have to clean I have to cook I have to do put this in order before on Monday you know so this video I wanted to do it in the home since uh, on Saturday I was busy yesterday I wanted to do it I was also busy I said okay since I've been busy <laughs> no you know let me just have the patience it can be that one of those days when I'm going to school while I'm doing my walking to school I will just do this video so I thank God for his for continuous faithfulness so today my daughter has gone to school also and I'm also going to school I said oh why I'm doing my walking let me do this video you know because sometimes to youtubers you know sometimes you might not blame them too much on the kind of topic they put in because they also want to like have viewers they also want to like have the money the YouTube is paying or sometimes maybe they don't know that that kind of a title they want to put is going to tarnish the image of a person it can be you know not everybody that thinks the same you know so to me I think this video that I watched from people other people's channel they said a word which I didn't like that's making me to do this video I have been looking videos everybody have a channel I have my channel individual knows what they want to do with their channel individuals knows the kind of topic to put on their channel individual knows what they want to bring up on their channel you know so which when you love the topic when you love what you are seeing you just click it and watch it you know so when I saw those videos in different shining I saw something which really pains me in my heart as a mother I couldn't hold it since I watched it three days ago I couldn't hold it I said oh I'm going to try to like do my best you know to express myself to like talk to people out there that if you are like doing a video as a youtuber you have to like reason very well sit down properly think about the topic very well if this topic is going to like attract you know viewers but it's not going to tarnish the image of anyone you know that you are talking about you know so I saw this uh, topic on people's channel says sick Genevieve I was like oh my god sick Genevieve and, and, and Genevieve is hospitalized in Texas in America and Genevieve is now a psychiatric patient ah, Jesus I was like what is happening you know so I now move over also to another person's China so to God be the glory I though the person also wrote something that Genevieve is uh, you know in the psychiatric in Texas on the topic also you know so the other one wrote sick Genevieve oh my god even the other one I'm just talking about didn't touch me as much as the one that wrote sick Genevieve oh my god how dare you as a youtuber ah, and you are a Nigerian and this person is a Nigerian Genevieve she's an our actress you are the person as a Nigerian you are the person who's supposed to cover her up 
Even if maybe really in Texas, we don't know if really she is sick. You don't have to like put that topic sick Genevieve. You are not a God. You are not a creator. You don't know if, even if this, our actress Genevieve, if she's sick, you don't know if people just want to tarnish her image. You don't know if people just want to spoil her name. So to me, sometimes you will see that we, the YouTube, we YouTubers, you will not blame us too much because why? We people, we, who we need to blame most is the newscasters. You know, so because these newscasters, they'll just go out there to bring out a news that is not real. Most of the news they are bringing out are fake. So when we YouTubers see this news, we begin to react to other news, you know. So, but when we are doing reaction, you will see that we, that are sensible, we will be able to put a topic that often when we are talking about somebody, we are not just going to like, if maybe they say someone stole, we are not just going to say, if they say Jacob stole something, we are not just going to like, you know, put it Jacob stole on the topic, you know. Uh, if they say, oh, Mary is a prostitute, we are not just going to put it like, oh, Mary, the daughter or the father of the son, or the daughter of this, or the family of this, she's a prostitute. No, as a sensible YouTuber, there is a way you are going to say, oh, they say someone stole. You know, there is a way you are going to like put the, the topic, you know, that is not going to tarnish the image of that person's name forever. So you, like, you want viewers and, uh, you know, you want people to, you want to, to be paid a huge amount from YouTube and you go out there to say, sick Genevieve, oh my God, beautiful people. It's, it touched me. I don't know how you think about what I'm about, like I'm trying to express. I don't know if I'm trying to like give like a meaning of something important for someone to learn something from. It's just that the way it touched me, I decided to do the video. If you have, you have already done this video, if there is a way you can go to your to your training and correct that sick Genevieve and just remove it completely and replace it with another title. As long as you have that viewers already, I don't think maybe the YouTube is going to like, you know, maybe like, uh, you know, remove from the money you are supposed to get that you are expecting that huge money that made you make that title, you know, so you can do something about it try to remove that sick Genevieve whoever any China you know you have and you have like oh written in your China as a youtuber or as a vlogger as a blogger whoever you know or a newscaster and you have already said like oh sick Genevieve Genevieve is in the uh, hospital oh uh, it's a car. Genevieve, uh, Genevieve uh, uh, has a meta problem oh my god I beg in the name of God you better try to do something about it try to cancel those title and write a correct title you can write a title of all oh, we don't know what is happening to our to our you know actress Genevieve people will see rush to see what you're about to say you know without not putting that tarnage you know what that tarnish uh, topic sick Genevieve just look at you are not a mother you are not the family of Genevieve. Okay, what if now tomorrow Genevieve come out to see all those videos you people did in your China? Sick Genevieve. Genevieve need a meta. Um, Genevieve have a meta problem. And uh, Genevieve have been taking drugs. Genevieve is in the psychiatric in the Texas. What if Genevieve sees these things tomorrow and she decides to sue you guys? So what are you going to do? You will see that. <laughs> I think uh, this traffic is not good, so we are just waiting on the line for long. Uh, ah, yeah, but uh, you don't know. Uh, <laughs> we are just waiting. Said what? 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 Ah, yeah, now it's green. Yeah, we were just waiting, and people were passing. You know, so we didn't know. <laughs> so it's like the traffic is not. Sometimes the traffic we stop for some time when it's like maybe too much cars i don't know so if, if maybe you know now genevieve comes out tomorrow you know as a youtuber you have already titled it on your china sick genevieve you have already titled it on your china genevieve is sick in Texas. you have already titled it on your china genevieve have a meta problem you have already titled it on your china 
uh, Genevieve uh, uh, is taking drugs. How dare you, as a Nigerian, and you say we are all Nigerians? And even if those things are real, which I think none of those things you guys put on your channel is real, you understand? Are you not the one who's supposed to use an umbrella to cover your sister? We are Nigerians. I am a Nigerian. I'm a Nigerian mother. I'm in Nigeria. I come from Nigeria, from Benin City. I don't can't say that, oh, because I'm from Benin City, that means I have to tarnish the image of an Igbo, Igbo lady, you know, so because uh, Genevieve, she's from Igbo. Being Igbo, being Benin, being Urobo, being Yoruba, being Aisako, being Ishikiri, we are all the same. We are all sisters. All the Nigeria sisters are my sisters. All the Nigeria women are my sisters. That is why anytime I see a video, I try to react to the video according to my heart. I will not say because I want to attract an audience. I want to attract viewers for that reason. I have to do a video and go and tarnish and put a topic, you know, that will tarnish the image of that person we are talking about. Please, whoever, you know yourself and if you come across this video or someone sent you this video you have made a topic on your channel tarnishing the image of our beautiful actress Nigeria actress you know Genevieve Nanji who is also a Hollywood, Hollywood actress please try to delete that topic and put another topic you know so that will help us you know as a nigeria we need to fight and stand for ourselves and in our in nigeria flag we have like um we have a uh, three colors in our nigeria flag which is green white green and do you know what those three colors stands for those three colors stands for three symbols love peace and unity and <laughs> the beautiful thing the most like worst thing is that those three symbols love peace and unity none of these three things we the nigerians we do to ourselves talking about love we the nigerians sorry to say not all not all the nigerians some of those nigerians okay let me start from being proud of our country okay now i'm going to give example of someone who i chatted with some months ago you know we nigerians most of we nigerians some of we nigerians we are not even proud outside to say we are from nigerians why because of why because of maybe when we were in africa what the nigerians did to us what we passed through in nigeria ship and everything you know not standing for each other you know and then maybe when we came to europe also as we're in europe we nigerians in europe we don't love ourselves Beautiful people, I will not lie to you. I'm going to supermarket, but I need to, like, you know, be true with this video. So let me just go to the street a, bit, a little bit. So, we the Nigerians, we don't like. Let me go to the sun side so that it can be bright a little. So we the Nigerians, we don't fight for ourselves. We don't stand for ourselves. We say we have uh, our in our symbol. We have unity. We have peace. We have love. Okay, let's start with the love. We the Nigerians, some of us, sorry to say, comment below what do you think, what have you seen as a Nigeria in Africa, if you are living here in Europe, as we and my daughter live here in Europe, what have you seen, the country you have, the city you have, the Nigerians around you. Now let's talk about love. Do we love each other? No. Most of the Nigerians, we don't love ourselves to start with. Okay, now let's talk about peace, love, love peace and unity. Peace, we cannot make peace. If maybe Nigerians see two, two couples, husband and wife fighting, instead of them to like sit down, sit these two husband, husband and wife down and ask what is the problem? What has happened? Maybe they didn't want to say like this man was beating the wife, but because some of them, they are single mothers, because some of them are already, or you know, they have already vowed to themselves like, oh, any woman they see with men, as long as they are single, they are going to make them single, separate them, you know. They will not even ask him, husband and wife, what is happening to so bring peace to so like, let's settle them, you know. The next thing you will hear, the, part, the person, you know, trying to like, coming in between them, we start to say, hey, what are you doing? You are quarreling with your husband every time. Or the man, if he's a man, we say, hey, 
Your wife is always nagging, 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 nagging. What are you still doing with that kind of wife? Won't you leave your wife and search for other women? Oh, we're not be nagging. Uh, this, you know, so we don't bring peace. Where there is, you see Nigerians like, you know, arguing, fighting, instead of you to bring peace, you don't bring peace to the Nigerians. Rather, you will even cause the situation, the argument even worse for the both people that are involved, you know. So now unity, the same thing. We can't stand Nigerians. Most Nigerians, they don't stand in unity. I, oh my Lord. Unity. They can't stand in unity. Anytime Nigerians are together, you will see the next thing. Before five minutes, they have like separated themselves. They have like, oh my God. They have like, I don't know. The thing will just move in them anytime they are in a group. You know, instead of them to like, Nigerians put be in unity together, before you know it, that group that was founded even by maybe an innocent person, one or two Nigerians that don't have unity, that don't love themselves, that don't have peace of themselves, they will just come in and just like scatter, you know, that group. And that group is scattered and it's forever. You see, so what I'm trying to say, we the Nigerians, our symbol is love, peace and unity. But most of we the Nigerians, we don't love ourselves. We don't, you know, we don't, ha we don't even like have peace. We don't, we don't, you don't even like which other people peace as a Nigerian. And also for unity, <laughs> that one is another thing. There is no unity. There is no unity between most Nigerians. So what I'm trying to say is that please, as a YouTuber, as a uh, blogger, as a blogger, please, anytime you are putting a title, whether the person is a Nigerian, let's use Nigerian because we're talking about our actress Nanji, you know, Genevieve Nanji. Please, any title you have put concerning she's sick, she's in the psychiatry, just try to delete it. I think time is coming where YouTube themselves will see a title that you like. You want to tarnish the image of somebody, they will just remove your video completely immediately. I think that time is coming. So when you watch any news when you see any news as a youtuber as a vlogger as a blogger try to like you know say things in that situation that will make the situation have like you know if maybe like okay let me talk about uh, about um um uh, our actor also you edushi everybody say oh he married the second wife he did this he has done the worst thing he has done but there are also many men and women out there marriages out there which their husbands have married moving up to like four five you know wives out there but nobody's talking about it so you don't even know what led to this man you know to marry a second wife and often if maybe you know, according to him, thank God he said his wife is one of the best wives so far. So you don't know what the second lady did to him. That, you know, if maybe she seduced him. So you don't really know what happened. So you just put on the, on the channel, oh, uh, uh, Yule Duche, uh, he's a bad man, he's a bad father, he's a bad husband. He's, you know, so there are some things as a YouTuber, we have to be mature. We have to be mature. There are some topic that you will put that even if you don't like tarnish the image of that person, you will even still have millions of viewers that you want to have. Then you writing sick Genevieve, hospitalized Genevieve. Genevieve is in the psychiatric just to like people to watch your channel. That is not nice. That is not you being a Nigeria supporting and standing for your sister. So beautiful people, hope you learned something from this video. I'm rushing to my school now. So thanks for watching. If you want to see more of this kind of video, or if you have any video you want, like we should like react to it, you know, feel free, comment below. By God's grace, we will do the video. So thanks for watching. See you in our next video by His Grace. We love you from Susan and Family TV. Please try to stop to tarnish the image of people just because of money, just because you want to have viewers. Thanks for watching. See you in our next video by His Grace. We love you. Remain blessed from Susan and Family TV. I'm rushing to go and buy Bionch and go to the school now. Bye. See you in our next video by His Grace. We love you. Remain blessed from Susan and family TV. Bye.